Hey, what's up guys? We want a chance at winning an awesome ultra rare bundle. The bundle will include not just one, but three ultra rares and three Pokemon booster packs. The ultra rares will be selected from this amazing ultra rare binder. There are full art trainers, full art Pokemon, and Mega EX Pokemons, and GXs of course. If you want a chance at winning this giveaway, all you gotta do is like, comment, and subscribe. And yes, we're giving away Hyper Rares, Secret Rares, and Shining Pokemon. This giveaway will drop once we hit 1,000 subscribers. Hey, how's it going guys? Welcome back to some more Pokemon TCG content. Today, we're opening up another Pokemon Sun and Moon Forbidden Light Booster Box. But today we're gonna doing it, we're gonna be doing it a bit differently, as you guys can tell from the thumbnail. We're gonna be opening the different pack cards individually. So how we're gonna do this is we're gonna separate this into four different videos. Each video features a different pack card. Today we're gonna be starting off with the Ultra Necrozma pack card. I figured it'd just be easier if I just go with whatever is on the front of the booster. Then we'll maybe we'll move move on to Naganadel. Zygarde and then Greninja. So let's go ahead and put the booster box on the side, let it chill over there, and focus on these Ultra Necrozma packs. So I'm not sure what I'm gonna be calling this series just yet, but I do I do collect um well, back in the day I do I did collect pack cards. So Oh no, okay, okay, this did not open very well. We're just gonna rip it open. Anyways, I'm gonna keep trying until I successfully rip open it. I pack super neatly, as neat as I can. But till then, we're gonna figure out which pack, oh, hold, hold on. This is one, two, three, this is the energy. This is an uncommon, we're gonna slide that right back. And we're good. All right, very first pack of the booster box. Let's do this. So basically, we're basically gonna see which pack card comes with the best pull. Let me know in the comment section below which one is your favorite and which one do you think will come with the best pull. All right, start off with the Gumi. Dupider, Fubebe, Esper, Fennekin, Fossil, Excavation Map, Zygarde, Dublade. Hey, you got a Arceus Prism Star and a Rotom Regular Rare. Hopefully, Arceus here can bless the rest of the booster box. Very first card from the booster box, so. Hopefully you can bless the rest of the pools. Very, very nice pull over there with that Arceus. All right, let's keep moving on. Oh, forgot I was gonna try to preserve the pack. Anyways, that was kind of a kind of a dirt move there. Take the energy out. Let's do this. Start over the give. Rock a rough. Gumi, Honage, Helioptile. Hey, mysterious treasure. Pretty good. Azelf, Spupa, Reverse Hollow Unit Energy, nice, nice, and a Magnezone, Hollow Rare. Pretty, pretty good. I guess I can count that as a hit. It's a Hollow, right? All right, we'll put that on the side. It's like a semi hitter. Definitely have to look over all the Hollows too. At the very end of this opening, and I am absolutely not doing a very good job at preserving these. These packs, these packs are, I gotta remember, okay, I will try my best to remember to open the next pack nicely. Are right, we start off with a skidoo. Noibat, Inke, Fennekin, Rockaruff, Rockonid, Klefki, Frogadier, Reverse Hollow, Alolan Executor, that is pretty sweet, and a regular rare Toxic Croak. I'm gonna count that as a hit. It is a reverse rare after all. If this was a booster box battle, or any pack battle, that reverse rare would count as a hit. So, oh my god, I am not doing a very good job. I used to be better at this. Or maybe I shouldn't expect expect myself to be that good at opening. Preserving the packs, I suppose. Eh. Maybe I should do this some other day when I have more time. <laughs> Alright. So that was the Cubone. Snover, Bunnel B, Binacle, Bergamot, Hoopa, Lysander Labs, Go Goat, Reverse Hollow, Halucha, that is an uncommon, and a Diantha. Hollow Rare. I don't, I haven't pulled a Diantha yet, so that is pretty sweet. Alright. I'm just gonna open this pack. Hopefully, we can get a Hyper Rare or a Secret Rare from this set, preferably 
the mysterious treasure i think that card looks absolutely amazing beast ring is really cool as well but in terms of design <clears throat> i really like mysterious treasure it looks gorgeous take the energy out okay start off with the bono b honich execute noibet magnemite judge azelf tyrant a reverse hollow auroras that is pretty nice and a florges regular rare all right we are down to our last four packs let's see what these four packs will hold and once again hopefully arceus gives up some really really sweet pulls okay that pack was definitely that uh, packaging was definitely ruined there take the energy out all right start off with a binacle rock rough gibble Flebebe Skidoo, Rakunade, Ultra Space, that's not terrible. Hoipo, that's pretty good. Reverse Hollow Scatterbug, and a Sylveon. Regular rare last three packs, ladies and gentlemen. Alright, Ultra Necrozma has got to step up its game, man. If they only get one Ultra Prism, only one Prism card from nine packs, that's uh. It will be difficult to beat the other pack cards. Let's just put it that way. Got you, boom! Bunnelby, Snover. Scatterbug, Rock Ruff, Miss Spirit, Flow It, Heliolisk, Reverse Hollow Magnezone, that is pretty pretty dupe, and a Xerneas GX. Very nice. At least we pulled the GX. Hopefully, we can get at least three regular GXs, maybe two full arts, that would be pretty nice, and that extra bonus card, the wild card being a secret rare or a hyper rare. That would make it a really good box. I mean, in terms of the regular GXs, I'm not asking for like a, I don't really need a ton of pulls, even if I only have three, it's the quality that counts, but when it comes to full arts and hypers, you definitely want to at least hit some, oh, accidentally put the energy there, alright, we have a Gibble, Clauncher, Noibat, Punchum, Esper, Mysterious Treasure, very nice, Metal Frying Pan, Magneton, Reverse Hollow Scatterbug, and a Buzzwool for the rare, that is actually a pretty good card, we're going to put it down here, as a very nice playable table card. Last pack. Gonna try to preserve the pack here. Uh, failing miserably. But hopefully the, the contents of the pack is good. Even though I did not do a good job of uh, preserving the pack there. Three. Take the energy out. Okay. Start over the dupe biter. Skitterbug. Inkay. Got a Gumi. Another Gumi. Spupa, will this be a triple goop pack? Cluff key. Gabite, yeah, nope. It is a reverse hollow rock rough and a pyroar. Hollow rare. So definitely we have a lot of hollow rares and reverse hollow rares from this portion. So that's not too shabby. We got three reverse hollow rares and three hollow rares. And we got both versions of the Magnus Zone. So that's pretty good. In terms of ultra rare pulls, I'm not sure if Prism Stars count as ultra rares. I think it does. Anyways, we have an Arceus Prism, which hopefully will bless the rest of the packs, and Xerneas GX. Very, very nice. Both really, really godly Pokemon. Alright, next pack art that we're gonna do is the. What should we call it? The. Po not Poi Pull, the Nag. Nagan. Nagan. I can't pronounce it correctly, guys. Naganadale. Naganadale pack art so stay tuned for that hopefully we'll get some pretty sweet pulls in that one and yeah that is all i have for y'all today i will be giving away some forbidden light online tcg codes to you guys because i want to show my appreciation to y'all so make sure to leave a comment leave a like so i can select the winner to end for the online code giveaways i'm thinking of giving away at least 10 from this booster box to one lucky winner so you guys have until the end of this the after I, until i finish opening this whole booster box to win these codes so thank you guys again so much for your support stay tuned for the rest of the booster box and take it easy guys